That's it. That's it. Steady does it. Oh, what a cock up. Whoa! What just happened? Did you... It happened again, and I wasn't attached to anything. It just lurched me. It's like I got picked up by an invisible hand and lurched towards the cliff. You've got the aliens again, have you not? Yeah, but maybe they're against me this time. Like, there is nothing on this bit of land. Well, you've had the, a lot of help Hang from on, I'm the gonna aliens. I'm going to get into F9. In different... Uh, there is, like, that land should... Like, there's no camber, there's no nothing. There's a little bit of a squelchy point there, which clearly uh, is made by me a minute ago. But there's nothing that should lurch me off. And look, look, did you see that? I just got lurched off. Okay, I'm going to reverse back and you're going to watch this on my screen because this is utter rubbish. Okay. Um, so. I'm sorry, if I stop now, I'm in a bit of a, bit of a pickle. When I do no, you're stop. Not. You can just break. Uh, yeah, no, it's not as easy as that. It, it, it's sort of, I'm going along in second and in a minute I'm going to. Uh, okay, that's it. Okay. Right, I can watch. Right. Ooh. So. I'm going to put my part break on for a minute. So you can see that I'm not attached to anything, right? Okay, you, if you want to talk, make sure your head's near my microphone. Okay, I'm going to now drive forwards, right? There's nothing around here, right, that would mean that I there's no camber. I mean, look at that. It's pretty flat, pretty darn flat, right? Yeah? So I'm going to drive along here. This should be the easiest thing. My hands are literally off the wheel. And all of a sudden, I'm lurched to the side. So, can you get a winch point up to the top? I will, but like that is so unnatural, isn't it? Yeah. And it's happened so consistently. Well, there's trees up there. Just hook yourself. Up. I know, but it's. Hang on, I'm going back into first. I am gonna. Okay, I'm gonna straighten my wheel, right? I am going to hold, and Prang is going to watch this, and make, if you say anything, make sure you shout so the microphone picks it up. I, my wheel is at 12 o'clock, dead straight, and I'm going to keep it exactly that way. I'm not going to turn my wheel at all. Are you ready? I'm going directly straight, and all of a sudden, I'm lurched off to the side. How weird is that? So I, I'm, I feel strongly that there is something wrong happening here, that means I shouldn't have the same punishment. Look! What? What? Well, I'm just laughing at this. Is there an invisible wall here? Like, is that what's happening? Well, try and winch off the... Which other winch points do you get? That's all, the only one I got. That one, and this one down here. I thought, because I, I was winching on this for a minute, yeah. and I thought that was why I had, um flipped the way I had but I feel a bit better now try that but like uh, that shouldn't be doing that but like yeah Prang's just saying I wonder if you can reverse him oh just pull my chair backwards but like that that's so unnatural isn't it there's some, there's some kind of bug. Prang just said, yes, it is. You're, you're leaning on my chair and it's tipping it back. And I am can't break properly. Don't need a winch. You, they can't hear you. You know when you're close enough to them. Okay, you can go back to yours if you want now. No, I just, I just wanted you to know that it is utterly a bug that is the reason that I had an accident there. So, oh, you're all the way up there. It is quite a lot easier, he says, getting stuck. Yeah? It was quite a bit easier in drive. Getting across this sand. Mm -hmm. on a bit stuck if I Well, the sun's know, coming up now, so hopefully that oh, allows me to sort out Hopefully the gremlins will disappear. Good grief. 
there's a, a story from where I come from. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> probably uh, made up. It's, it's obviously probably made up for tourism. Things. But uh, Dartmoor is a oh, okay. place in the middle of Devon. And it's more Devon's a county in the UK, just, yep. to, just if you're not familiar. Um, the, the fine, the beautiful county of Devonshire, glorious Devon. And uh, Dartmoor's in the middle, and it's uh, 365 square miles, which is 924 square kilometres, because I looked it up the other day for some other reason. Yeah, I was just going to say, he's actually remembered this as opposed um, to um, reading it off Wikipedia or something. And... trying to get extract myself and not do terribly well here. Um, what am I in? Now, anyway, um, getting back to... Uh, um, Dartmoor. Dartmoor. Um, there's a, an area where people reckon they've been driving along at night and hairy hands come out and grab their steering wheel and force them off the road. Oh, wow. The hairy hands of oh, right, Postbridge, just past Postbridge. Um, <laughs> and uh, it's an uh, interesting thought. You know, there's been apparently a couple of sort of oh, this accidents so there over the last probably 50, 60 years. But... Um, mm. You know, maybe it was sort of made up by a newspaper man way back. And you know the way things get into people's heads. Yeah, and they, yeah. They sort of imagined it. Um, and then when two or three crashes happen, you know, it, 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 it fuels that sort of thing. And, uh, All right, let's see if I can get out of this. Because, I mean, I, I once on. hit a cow. Um, it oh, was, was it okay? Um... It ran off. I couldn't. Oh, okay. It was, it was alive to the best of your knowledge. Pitch black night, I was doing about... Oh, come on! Sorry, I think you need to bleep that bit out. <laughs> you don't need to bleep it. I didn't swear. Well, no, but I mean, someone's sitting there watching it, <laughs> drinking a cup of coffee. They just <laughs> spilt the coffee over their lap. I've got now. so much compression going on it. Like, I think I've got about three limiters <sighs> by the time it gets exported. There's a lot of fine. compression on their coffee as well, I think. <laughs> I just... I tried to go around the other way to get into this place, and it didn't work. I'm sorry, continue. Things get into people's heads. They well, think it's something because they've heard it's something. Yeah, and then, you know, you just sort of... Uh, what I was saying was I hit a cow. That's right. And... Um, was it a hairy cow? The hairy hooves. Okay. I'm in, I'm in How is my truck down there? How? Okay, look, I'm going to be honest. I'm cross with the um, aliens for tipping my truck, like, off the edge. I'm not that mad about them right now because they've now got my truck upright again. What on earth is happening? I'm so confused. So anyway, it was, I was doing about 10 miles an hour because on the lookout for uh, livestock on the open moor, Mm-hmm. After dark, it's misty, it's as black as your hat. So just to clarify, you were on a road. I was driving on a road. Yeah. And, um... But it was this cow in just, open just, moorland. There was a black cow in the blackness, just appeared in front of me. And uh, I just sort of hit it a bit. It smashed my, uh, uh, the lens, well, the, the cover of the light, you know, the main light. Uh, headlight. Headlight, yep. Yeah. Um, just an ordinary vehicle, quite a thick light, you know, but um, I'm saying, but uh, uh, and there was a bit of blood on the. Come on! So I would have had a, a bit of a cut, but that was all, you know. So, um, you 
you're not getting along this track because of Brendan's. Well, I'm just trying to unlock this watch point. I can I can bypass the watch point. You can probably drive into it so easily from the opposite direction. No, I, I went around that. That's when I had the big screen. Okay, set up a dead end. Yeah. Okay. Sort of. Well, it seems that there might be another um, block there. Okay. Oh, is this, this is going to work in. But like we never had this issue when we played it before. Let's I don't know what's happening. In first. Do I go across here? Help me map. Yep. I did go across here. Okay. So this is just such utter rubbish. Maybe Torridon saw high water and he thought, I'm going to really screw with them now. I'm going to update uh, Longridge so that they're really stuck. Well, no, I think you've just got the... I just think you have got on your... Um, um, what's it? The... Um, on your server. But My client? Yeah. I think you've, you've um, accidentally put in the, uh, the Poptergeist mod. I think you're not wrong. Hang on. Okay, this is weird. I want you to watch my screen right now. Okay, hang on a sec. Right, okay. Okay, whenever... I, I'm, at, I'm trying to reverse up to that spot. A bit first. Whenever I reverse my truck down there, or whenever I reverse and am attached to that, perhaps my truck down there. Yeah, look, it's moving in the same direction. I stop, it stops. This is not a good angle to be positioned on. Is that not super weird? Yeah, it makes you feel you want to get out and walk, doesn't it? Well, it's bloody three metres away. Why, I just... I don't see any reason why I can't just walk over there. The poor boy. Oh, I might be doing it. It's like three meters away. Well, slightly more than three meters, but four meters away. I'm just stuck against this invisible, stupid wall. Why do you have to make me so sad, Toradon? Right. And why do I have to do it in the B130? Of all trucks. Well, anyone can do it in the big 6x6s or even the 8x8s. No, no, I mean, like, why have I got to sort out something getting, uh, well, exactly. like, overcoming this bug? That's what I'm saying. Like, normally, fair enough, like, there's a challenge. But I've, I've now got to sort out a bug. Yeah, but I mean, you know, anyone can sort of sort out the bugs in the big trucks. I mean, wow. you've now got to, whoops, don't like that. You've now got to sort of. It's only real drivers that can sort out the bugs in there. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, for crying out loud, turn it on. I'm thinking it might be time for us to stop and have lunch. Um, yeah, sure. Are you I okay just, with that? Um, I'd just like to sort of 
get my okay. vehicle from well, what I was trying to you, you do that and I'll just talk for a bit I was trying to get this rear up on top of there so I could try and drive over the top of this bit because I've tried going through there and it feels like there's another invisible wall there although it's very hard to check because it's in a massive ditch and I'm in a you know two wheel drive not very strong truck yep um I suppose at this point, I don't think I'm going to get up there. I suppose at this point I need to um, see if I can recover the bee. Bee chap. It's going to be a bit difficult to be honest. Look, I feel that given how much I've been screwed around, I can jump in the map and jump down to him. He's only 20, 30 metres away. Oops. If you can walk, you've got to walk. Yeah, but look, I've been screwed around by this bug. I feel, I feel it's really... Yeah. Like I wouldn't have fallen down there if it weren't for this bug. Yeah. So okay. I feel really quite okay about it. Um, oops. Okay, now you stay there, little truck. Come on. I'll spin it around. I'll get. Change track. I'll get that one. And now I'm going to get up out of the water so I can go and have something to eat. Okay, whoops. Park brake off. And get away. And we oh, should just be able to wrap this around here. Big Prang Island. Congrats. back on and that's off hats and off hats off that's <laughs> off and stored the engine we're high and dry a big pretty island okay b130 i'm going to get you to give me some fuel so um Are we stopping? Yeah, just give me two secs. I just want to give myself okay. some fuel so I'm ready for the next time. Just get myself on the flat here so I know. Okay. Fuel me up. Before you go, go. Oh, the B66 only has 160 litres. Yeah. yeah. Wow. It's actually it's very economical considering that. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm ready to stop when you are. Okay. Is that is that now? Um, it's sort of now. It's yes. sort of now. Make yep. sure you're talking to the microphone a bit better. Okay. You ready? All right. Yep. Okay. Well, thank you very much for watching. We've had some very bizarre things happening, but we'll certainly be back. I don't believe any of it. You saw. <laughs> <laughs> Wait! What? How is my B130 there? I parked it up on the... There's something so weird going on here. Ladies and gentlemen, um, he always says this. He sort of tips the truck over and then he says, how on earth did that happen? He does this every season. I just, I don't know. <laughs> just joking. No, I parked it up, because I parked it up there. I said, well, make sure this is nice and straight, because I thought, if this moves again, no, it's I'll, right, want I an, I'll want it, because I thought, I believe oh, there is something so wrong here. Are these trucks, like, attached? So anyway, maybe it'll fix itself by coming back in the game when we start next time. Okay. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. We'll be back to continue this adventure. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.